Kelly Van Washenova here, and I'm going to show Denison faculty members how to set up courses in Noteboll. If this is your first time using Noteboll, you'll need to go ahead and log in before you can access Noteboll. Once you log in, you're on the All Bulletins page. We're going to focus on the Courses area. And when you click on the Courses area in the navigation, you will notice that there's a Current, Upcoming, and Past Course tab. If the semester start date has not yet passed, you will have no current courses listed. Those courses will be listed under upcoming. So for spring semester 2021, since the semester does not start for two weeks from today, from the day I'm recording this, all of my courses are listed in upcoming. If you have not yet opened one of your courses yet, it will be listed as not published. To go ahead and get started, simply click on the course and Noteboll will take you right into a course setup wizard. You can go through the course setup wizard by clicking get started, or you can just skip over the course setup wizard and you can set everything up in the course shell. If you click get started, it's going to prompt you through all of these steps to get your course set up. This first step, you can enter details like available date. Just because you publish your course, it does not mean that students can see it yet. That will be triggered by the available date. So even if I complete this course setup wizard, my students will not be able to see it until the 31st of January at 12 a.m. I can click next to go through all the steps of the setup wizard, including importing other material from previous courses, choosing my grade display setup, setting up my grade scale, entering ISBN numbers of books. And then in the final step, I can choose to publish. Again, it will not be available until the available date, even if I choose publish course. The next video will continue with the bulletin tab within the courses. Thank you.